scrambled words is basically like an old decoder game. What you're going to basically do is open the scrambled words file in Microsoft Word, then type into this middle section the word or phrases or words that you want the students to, de to decipher. So I'm going to give you an example. I'm going to type the word hello. H-E-L-L-O. And after I've typed that, here are the symbols now that represent those letters. I'm actually going to just highlight that and make it bigger so it's a little easier to see. And what I'm going to do is now use the code down here to actually decode these words, uh, these letters that are up here. The way it would work is that you would place this basically into, uh, you would print this out, place it in the student's hands. You could give it to two students or just individuals, and then they would um, race to see who could decode it the quickest. So for example here, I'm going to see the letter H is here with these two squigglies. So the student would write the letter H there. Then over here, we see the letter E is that kind of uh, weird looking M. And we put an E there. And then down here, we see we have two L's with two circles. So we put LL there. And then finally, there is the O with the square. So we would have the word hello. Again, some tips for using these are they're excellent for pre-reading activities. You can give these to your students with highlighted words or phrases from a reading passage that you want them to do. And uh, there's a lot of uh, good research that says that doing that type of activity can help them retain what they read. Um, other tips about these, um, number one, remember always to use lowercase letters. Everything down here is a lowercase letter or number, so do not use capitals. If you use capitals, it will not work. In addition, um, there are different fonts, so make sure that when you download one like Wingdings or Wingdings 2 that you actually have that font. If you look down here and you do not see fancy little symbols and stuff when you open the template, then that means you do not have that font and you need to use a different one. I've included four different uh, scrambled words up there on the web, so I, one of them should be one that you have on your computer.